thoughts in your head at, at two five? I know you shared some of them with your racket, but I, I'm just curious what how you turned it around and from there. Well, yeah, I had to do something, so I did this thing with the racket. It wasn't really clever, but <laughs> maybe it helped. So um, I still lost the game after when I smashed the racket, but uh, she was on fire, so there was not much things to do. So I was just somehow trying to stay there. But um, yeah, then finally she did some mistakes, and uh, when it was 5 2, I think she got a little bit tight and shaky. And she actually, actually said it to me now in the locker room that she was tight. So. Um, yeah, so till five all, I didn't. I served just one game well, and otherwise, I was just trying to put the balls back and waiting if if she's gonna get tired and she got. So um, it wasn't much about me. Still, um, she was the one who was more aggressive today and uh, going for the shots, and she was playing really fast, really well. I think so. Also deserved to win, but uh, unlucky in the end for her. Carolina, yeah, you said on court that you thought that she she was the better player maybe today, but your stats are phenomenal for the match. You didn't have more than 18 unforced errors, over 40 winners, 19 aces. So why did you feel like maybe it wasn't as much on your racket? Well, I think she was the one who was more aggressive, so I was not. Um, I didn't have any chance almost to get go for my shots and play just the, the game what I'm. Uh, normally playing, so she was pushing me from the when I had second serve. She was pushing me from my second serve, even from uh, when she serves first. She still was making the pressure on me, so which cannot happen. But there can be matches like this, so I just am really happy that I get through it. And even it was not uh, my game and it was not easy match, then it still counts. It's a win. So um, just I think the only thing what I'm um, pleased with is was my serve in the third set. I was saying, I think I had a high percentage of the first serve, actually, finally. Very high. <laughs> yeah, how much? 76, Yeah, yeah. I felt. <laughs> yeah. How, how good does it feel in those sort of late moments to know that you have a big serve and it's working well? Because you got some easy holds near the end, which I'm sure felt pretty good. I had few. She had actually as well, because she was uh, not only serving well, but playing really well from the baseline, really fast, flat shots. So... Uh, but obviously it's a big help. Uh, it's always a little bit more pressure on the opponents uh, when you know you can serve well. Obviously there can be game when I don't serve well, but still there's the pressure on them. So after fighting your way out of that, it was a close call. Are you, are you more relieved or happy or frustrated? or When? What, what are you feeling? About now? Yeah. The match? Are you more happy or relieved? Or how do you feel? Of course I'm happy. <laughs> um, it's the first time when I'm actually in the third round here, so it doesn't matter how I played, how I won, or what happened there, I just, I'm through, so that's the more, most important thing for me, and uh, I'm just going to try to improve. I had some easy matches now um, in the past, even with the Brisbane, I just had one tough match against Vinci, so now a few easy ones, so I think I needed the hard one. What do you think about now having to take on an Aussie on her home court? I'm um, excited. I just got to know that I'm playing Dasha, so we played once, I think. Uh, definitely we're going to play again on a big court, which is a good thing. I'm used to having the crowd against me, so nothing's going to surprise me. And uh, I think I'm going to have the chance to play now my aggressive game, then not like today.